Okay, I'm just continuing off my other video. Uh, unfortunately, it had paused on me for some reason. But this is my son's bow. This is the one that I spent the most time on. You can see the limbs are absolutely perfect on this bow. Could not ask for anything better. He has killed several things with this little bow. Squirrels, as I forgot to mention in the other video, uh, it would be hard to tell you how many squirrels I've killed with that uh, bow of mine. And my brother also has killed a couple of squirrels with his bow. But it's just fun to shoot frogs. We like to frog gig with them. And uh, that's typically what they're used for. Even though, like I've said, I have killed other animals with them. Um, the deer, of course, being the biggest. Uh, I can't take pride in saying that the deer uh, I killed, I did with a, a traditional arrow. I didn't. I used just a regular carbon arrow. But I did use a uh, longbow to kill the deer, and it was the one that I showed earlier. But as I say, this is Justin's bow. I'm going to set them down. My brother's just demonstrating some of the power of the bows. We got a little tin can here. It's not very far. Uh, we're kind of fearful about doing that. You can see why we have our precious little babies here all over the place and we can't really afford to, to shoot our arrows, and especially in the rain and have them glance off something and hit one of them. We love these guys more than anything. But you can see with the can, he's getting pretty close. He's not very far. I, I don't want to deny the truth. He, he might be seven, eight yards while he's shooting, but he's, he's not doing too bad. There you go. And, of course, like I said, these bows are not even being drawn full, you know.